Hey, what's up, guys? I just wanted to show you a quick problem I'm having with my Volkswagen Jetta here. It is the uh, 2.0 four cylinder automatic 99. The car seems to go into limp mode whenever I drive it. Whenever I drive it, I'll show you a little more as soon as I pull into a different spot here. As you can see, everything looks normal on it and uh, whatnot. But this just happened yesterday out of nowhere, so let's see here. Everything seems to be all right. I mean, the check engine's been on since I've had the car, so. Um, as you can see, everything looks all right. And uh, let's see, I'll put it in reverse. Start driving it. All right, now. As I put the car into drive, see that? As soon as I put it into drive, well, every single one lights up and it's saying, well, it's telling me that the car is in limp mode. Now, it does not shift or anything. I've been driving the thing like crazy, trying to figure it out, resetting stuff, resetting the transmission control thingy, and Nothing seems to work at this point. Let me just turn around here. I don't want to make this video too long, so make it as quick as I can. All right. Now car is in limp mode. It won't shift. Just, you know, I think I'm thinking about going to advanced auto to get some further info, but uh, if I open the hood here, uh, give you guys a quick view. Alright, as you can see, this little hose right here, where is it? This little hose had broken off. And this returns water to the reservoir. And it shot all over, as you can see, you can probably see the coolant in there. It shot all over a couple plugs in here. Like the uh, solenoid connector plug. And I'm guessing that's what caused it. I mean, I didn't realize it when I was driving. It just, uh, I opened the hood to take a look why it was in limp mode and I seen this hose was off. So I figured that's why it's doing it. I mean, anybody who knows about this car, maybe could give me some info of what might have happened. Maybe the water, sh I don't know, maybe the water got on a, a sensor down here. That sensor right there, that's the, uh, I don't know if you can see it, but that's the uh, solenoid one. And then it's soaked one that's right next to here. And one up there. So, I don't know what could be causing it, but I'm guessing that's why. I don't know what to do. I'm dumbstruck on what to do. I have no idea. Anybody that could give me some info or help me out before I sell the damn thing. Just because of this, when it might be just, you know, a simple 50 bucks or 100 bucks or something, you know. I had this happen in a Jeep. I took it to a transmission guy. The guy charged me 700 bucks to, to, to do a, a, put a new solenoid in it. I mean, I'm, I don't know if maybe the water hit that plug and, you know, fried a solenoid, I don't know, but, you know, any help would be greatly appreciated.